What's up guys, it's Julia. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. I make tons of videos on fine and thin hair and also a little bit of fashion, lifestyle, and beauty, so make sure to hit that subscribe button before you leave. Today's video is going to be an updated uh, version of my favorite products for fine and thin hair. I did this about two years ago. You guys seem to really be interested in it and like it, but a lot of the products that I love now are updated. So this is an updated version of what hair products I'm loving lately for fine and thin hair. So let's just hop straight into the video. All the products will be linked in the description box down below and let's get started. All right, so starting from the order of in the shower and onwards, my favorite shampoos and I have been trying so many shampoos, you guys. My favorite is by the way, it's the volume shampoo and also this dry bar Southern Belle volume boosting shampoo. Now, um, my hair type is very straight, flat, thin and really fine. So I need all the help I can get. And these are the two that I notice um, clean my hair the best. They don't weigh it down. They don't make it flat. Um, they don't make it super oily or greasy because they're not like overly hydrating or moisturizing. So I love these two. These are my favorites and I kind of just alternate back and forth. The next are two products that I use post shower. So I spray these in my hair when my hair is wet. My all time favorite still is the Way Wave Spray. I'm absolutely obsessed with this one. Some of some wave sprays or sea salt sprays I notice can tend to be a little bit heavy. This one is not, and you can see I like absolutely love it. I'm almost done with it. Um, but it just smells amazing. It's a lightweight sea salt spray, which is perfect for fine and thin hair because it's not gonna like really weigh it down and give it like too much texture sometimes you can do too much product in fine and thin hair and it'll make it like overly greasy or weigh it down. So I love this one. I'm obsessed with it. I cannot live without it. And then also for more of like my root area, the wave spray, I like to um, spray towards the bottom ends of my hair. I love the way volume spray. This one for roots especially and um, it just gives me a little bit of lift in my hair at the root, especially when I blow dry it. So I love this guy, this one at the root and the wave spray kind of downwards or like from the from here down absolutely love the way I'm obsessed with them I love their Instagram they're just like the cutest brand ever and um, I would love to try more of their products but these are the ones so far that I really like but I'm sure like I know they have great hairsprays and stuff like that so these are just my favorites so far that I've tested out next I always like to put something on my ends because since I have really fine thin hair um, I tend to like to use a lot of volumizing shampoos things that almost tend to like dry your hair out a little bit so I have to make sure I'm hydrating my ends so that they don't get super dry and brittle so I've been loving this Kerastase um, Nectar Thermique it's basically like a nourishing milk for dry hair and I use it just towards the ends but I just think this is gorgeous it's like does not weigh down your hair at all it's not too creamy it's just a really nice lightweight milk smells amazing and it's perfect for ends because it's not too heavy um, and it just really gives you the hydration that you need without weighing down the hair. I also love, and I mentioned this in my last version of this video, but the Orbe Hair and Body Oil. And this is great also for, um, for ends and I'll use this on the ends of my extensions as well, but um, I just use it in a very small amount because it definitely can, it is an oil, so you just have to be careful. Or if it's like a Sunday and you just wanna like let your hair get a lot of moisture and it will just look greasy see I will spray a ton of this in the bottom ends of my hair and just let it like drink it in kind of like a hair mask um, so you definitely need to make sure that you're taking care of your hair even if it's fine and thin on some days you want to just give it a ton of moisture um, to give like life back into it because it's super fragile and it definitely needs hydration and it can't handle a ton of like heat and color and stuff like that so make sure you're giving it moisture um, I love these two products to give me like a little bit of boost of hydration but don't skip out on that. Next are two kind of like texturizing sprays for when your hair is like all done. You can kind of just like spray this in to give it some texture. One is the Living Proof Full Dry Volume Blast. This is basically like a really dry texturizer spray that just gives you a little bit of lift. It's amazing and it smells so good. All of the Living Proof products smell amazing, but great product, kind of like texturizing finishing product. 
The other one that I love is the Kicker by Dry Bar, but this is more of a waxy finish. So I really can only do one to two sprays on each side because I don't want it to get, make my hair too sticky or um, it'll just like weigh it down and make it kind of greasy. So if you have thicker hair, you can probably go wild with this, but for us fine and thin haired girls, just be careful. One to two sprays, but it does give you a really, really nice texture. It's a really nice stronghold hairspray. This is the Warden by Dry Bar and man this stuff is stronghold you guys like I normally cannot get my curls to stay for more than like a day they will fall out because my hair is so straight and like just flat and just sucks um, so this stuff seriously though like it holds and it holds for like three days like the curls and I've never had a hairspray that's really done that so um, this one is absolutely amazing it's a really strong hold though so just don't expect your hair to like really move or like be uh, like brushable it's just really very firm hold all right and this might be my ride or die hair product that I absolutely can't live without I think it is actually my hands down this is the Dove dry shampoo you guys this is like a treasure in the drugstore but it needs to be the volume and fullness um, version of the dry shampoo a lot of dry shampoos make my hair more greasy I don't know about you guys but this one is the only one that actually works for my hair it almost gives it more of like a drying texture so it really soaks up the oil and gives it grit and texture without weighing down without being greasy and it's like seriously the only dry shampoo that really works for me it's absolutely amazing and it's heaven I just hope that they never like make it super expensive or anything like that so I will literally go through a bottle of this in like a week and a half or two weeks um, so I just like stock up because they're like two dollars or 2.99 so this guy is a total gem and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. All right, you guys, that's gonna be all the products that I just absolutely love for fine and thin hair. These work the best for me, but I've had a ton of trial and error, and you just kind of have to play around and see what works for you. My number one tip is to not apply too much product. Just be like gentle with it because it can actually do the opposite for our kind of hair and end up like weighing it down and making it greasy and stuff like that. So I will link um, some of my other popular hair videos down below if you guys want to check them out. Don't forget to subscribe again and thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.